redefining art through education and entertainment. Intricism. Hello there. I'm George Putnam. I'd like to begin with a fact. A simple yet shocking fact. It is threatening to pervert an entire generation of our American children. We know that once a person is perverted, it is practically impossible for that person to adjust to normal attitude in regard to sex. Abnormal sex, 75 to 90 percent of it ends up in the hands of our children. The teachers of unnatural sex act, violent obscenity within reach of every man, woman, and child in the country. Dirt for dirt's sake. Today's youth can be stimulated to sexual activity for which he has no legitimate outlet. He is even enticed to enter the world of homosexual, homosexual, lesbian, lesbian, sadist, sadist, masochist, masochist, and other, and sex other sex. The psychiatric terms for these unnatural sex acts are unknown to most decent adults in our country. Perversion for profit. They constantly portray abnormal sexual behavior as being normal. They glorify unnatural sex acts. They tell youngsters that it sparks, it's thrilling, it provides kicks to be a homosexual, a sadist, and every other kind of deviant. This moral decay weakens our resistance to the onslaught of the communist masters of deceit. The mysterious force of sex can wreck them for life. Dark nudity on slick paper, intercourse, or other sex acts stimulates the nakedness, the nudity. Not only display complete nudity, they do so in a perverted manner. The sodomist, preoccupation with a female breast, that it has become a fetish, bestiality, and with lesbian implications of the God-given gift of sex, sexual activity, and again, the breast fetish. Group exposure is a hallmark of these cults. Very few blind people join the nudist colony. Total anatomical detail is a young boy in Philadelphia raped and killed a five-year-old girl while he was testified that he had been stimulated to this heinous crime by reading a nudist magazine with a homosexual viewpoint. Perverse consequences to the inexperienced youth becomes a pawn for these misfits. These homosexuals who have a slogan that betrays the evil of the breed. Today's conquest, they say, is tomorrow's competition. See the tender age at which homosexuals prefer their conquest. Seduction of the innocent. Poor young lad, and more of the same, transvestite, wherein the wearing of female garment is that which provides dream sex fight appeal and the tight and boot. Thus, they grow the riding costuming with a blade upon the cigarette and a field of the side of leather garment. The sexual of whip, sadist, sexual property, of a violation cult, how to buy erotic. Famous confession of a party cross dressers afraid of sex fetishes in the lace, the pleasure of pain. Human zoo. Inhabited by raped, mutilated, and murdered females. And by females, outmatching in bestiality, cavemen, and outlusting the lustiest of animals. Male and female alike are hardened in cynical contempt of human life and value.